Hello my lovely Leos, welcome, welcome to this reading. My name is Mia and today we are going to do, haha, uh -huh, three of cups are jumping out, I'll have that. We are going to do a September 2022 reading. Yes indeed, your season is over. Is the party over? I don't think so Leo, because I think your party is ongoing. How are you Leos? I really hope you're doing great. Just keep in mind, this is not one-on-one -on -one reading, this is a general reading for Leo, Sun, Moon and Rising. So take the messages that resonate with you and drop the rest. And have you considered or have you already subscribed to my channel? Don't be shy, join in. Let's have fun together writing. Leos, what's coming in for you at the beginning of September, middle of September and end of September? Alrighty, I'm going to take three cards from the bottom for this special message that we're going to have a look later on. Alrighty, let's dive in. Beginning of the month. My oh my, Leos, I think this Queen of Wands is in every sign's reading. It is such a, it is such a very, very sticky card. I have to say sticky card, but it's there every there. But there is a message for that. And just keep in mind, we do have full moon in Pisces in 10 September. And in, in Pisces, so it is kind of sometimes bringing some Pisces energy, such as deep thinking, going into bigger, deeper waters, um, exploring something else, being a bit mysterious. However... For you, my friend, Leo, it's kind of a little bit different story. A little bit different story. It kind of feels that you are really putting the big girl's boots and big boy's boots on and you are stepping out of your comfort zone and you are going a little bit into, into something unknown and you are really prepared to roll up your sleeves and just dive in because once is talking about willpower, one's is talking about opportunities at work or anywhere else in the world and knight of swords is a movement card and especially with the swords it is talking about your beliefs etc etc your thinking your minds your mindset and it's quite feisty quite aggressive and quite action orientated i'm gonna take a card from the side oh. righty i i can see which side you which way you're going and you are not jump, just jumping in. It's quite... It feels that you are really going into the area which you really love. Either that already is changing um, career or profession. I'm not sure there yet. But you are putting the little seeds down towards things that you like to do. Because Hierophant is urging each one of us to somehow... Find time to do things that we love, do things that feed our soul and benefit the world. I know, maybe sometimes we are all for ourselves, but even if that's the case, do things that you really like, even a little bit. But, seems here, you are really diving into that. You are not even, there is no second thought about it. And opportunities are coming, if you would like to see them. And... And I don't see anything that's going to stop you, Leo. you are really set your mind onto something. And you're prepared to even wait if needed. You're going to wait for that right moment. You're going to wait for that particular position if you're going for an interview or something. Posi particular kind of opportunity. And you're quite calculative. I like it. I really like that. Yes, indeed. Leo's middle of the month. Wow, money's on your mind. Whose isn't? It kind of feels a very lovely, lovely month here. The middle of the month is really... Oh, kind of... Do you know what, I, what I see? Is you're putting your feet up. You're having a good time. And you kind of feel like this Nine of Pentacles energy. You are looking after your finances. You're looking after your life. Body, mind and spirit. All three. And you kind of in a good place. And when you're in a good place, Leo, I think the whole world is in a good place. Because when Leo is hungry, <laughs> oh, bless. But you kind of really feel really content. 
really nicely content. I'm going to take another card for the. Uh huh. Alrighty. Even though you are very content, you're still working. And I, I really like that about you, Leo, where you find the time to have a party. You really find the time to look after yourself, having good time, good night's sleep, because that is so important. Even a moment where you are really on the deadline, where you are really are like looking at the clock and things need to be done. And you are not quitting five minutes before. And I kind of feel you might have a very good advisor here very good advisor or professional or even maybe friend who is giving you very great advice leo i know you don't need much advice you're kind of king on your own <laughs> right but there could be some good information coming towards you to not to quit things five minutes before and stick it through as well not just that as well seeing other opportunities that are coming along Mm -hmm. and i think that person could be with you for some time already very interesting but however it really really feels i think it kind of really feels that you want to prolong this august your leo period and you just want to work hard party hard have a good time enjoy the life because look we live only once, but if you live right, once is enough, right? Alrighty, let's have a look. What is the end here? Yes, indeed. Leo, you are really kind of, really calm. Especially now at the end of the month on, on the September 25th, we have a new moon in Libra, which is talking about relationships. And it kind of feels that anyone else may be having some, some muddy waters. Anyone else may have some love and relationship issues. But in Leo household, everything is hunky dory. Absolutely. You keep keep working away. You love what you're doing. You're prepared to put energy in. Fine. What's not to like? Your head is really mature. You are prepared that there could be some bumps. So what? I'm Leo. I'm getting over it. My Leo way. And nothing's going to stop me from my, um, my, my journey. And I'm getting there. I'm getting there. Did you hear me, Leo? Every the rest of the world, Leo. I'm Leo and I'm getting there. No matter what. It's my goal. And if that means I'm selfish, yeah. Chapter one, selfishness. Because if I don't look after myself, someone else has to look after yourself, right? It's really nice. I like it. I really like it. Oh, <laughs> interesting. Here it comes to relationships. Someone might have wanting to so put put the beak in your life. You don't like that. You're very pri you do like to share things, but there is a certain things you like to keep private, and I like that, Leo. And and you might want to kind of juggly act here, whether how to respond to that. Someone's trying to put mud at you. Someone's trying to put some bad word about you. And I don't like it, and you don't like it. And you might have a bit of time to think how to better react. Do you know what? You're going to do, probably what you're going to do is just keep digging in and making the success. Because we got 10 pentacles. There is big cashing in coming in. And you're going to literally, you are up here. You're working, working, working. Your energy up high. Your vibrations up high. And someone's on the bottom here. Lower energy is trying to get to you. Trying to mud your waters. You're not even looking there. You're not even reaching them. Don't lower yourself. Don't lower yourself for no or nothing. Stay up there. And you won't even hear that noise that's down there. Mm -mm, because you vibrate on completely different frequency. And keep up there, Leo. Absolutely there. And let the... The mud go where it needs to go. Off. Off. Next. Alrighty. What is a special message? Ooh. Keep it cool. And I know sometimes we want to say what we want to say, but not this time. Do you know what? It's not even worth it. The hassle. You have bigger things to do. You have bigger fish to fry. You will be grafting your socks off. And you like doing it. Hold on to the certain things because sometimes there might be some 
doesn't say here, but there could be some scammers or some sort of things that look very shiny. Keep on top on your finances, as you do already. But just keep on top because you never know. My need for investment, my need for some bills or something un unplanned. And the King of Cups is, is, is someone who is the same as Queen of Cups. Is really knowing how to manage people. The people skills, I know you're A1, but it will be very important, especially if they're close to you, family or friends. And sometimes they don't feel to what they say. And they think that they are they think that they are entitled to just dump their opinion on top of you without thinking about the consequences, without thinking how you're feeling about it. They say, oh, I'm just saying. Well, don't say that, right? Just keep cool beans or try to avoid the limits them um the time you spend with that such people right just say you're busy you work 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 and it's a great excuse and kind of keep an eye as well for new opportunities that are coming maybe you are want to expand or you want um i don't think it's great for expansion yet because there might be some un, unplanned costs maybe coming in and you might need to cover those costs but kind of look where you can maybe improve your um what you're doing at work or your hobby or is your hustle right leo if this resonates with you thumbs up thank you so much that really would benefit me and my channel let's have a look what monology cards the very chatty what they would like to add for you for september leo leo let's have a look uh-huh there we are. What do you need to release? Your dreams need a practical plan. Releasing definitely is this energy that is maybe trying to sabotage you. Your dreams need a practical plan. I think you're very practical. Sometimes you're daydreaming and thinking of things, but that's how ideas grow, right? That's how ideas grow, I think. Okay, what's happening? The world is your oyster. And this old bird here is this old knowledge of everything. Oh, let it go. It's releasing. What do you need to release? There could be some, maybe some, something has built up from the past few months and so. And maybe you need to release something. You can do just simple meditation or just saying out loud or in within yourself. I release everything that doesn't serve me no good. You know, I'm breathing in and out. And with your strong intentions, simple as that. It's all gone. It's all gone. And look how beautifully this person is kind of looking at the world and the planets moving around. And it's kind of like the feel of when the money is coming in, when the good fortune is coming, when the good gifts are from the universe coming in. You're like looking at them and like thinking, oh, are they for me? Yes, they are Leo for you because enjoy them really enjoy them if you know how to be grateful and accept presence from universe you're gonna get more and more of that it is safe for you to be powerful you know how to be powerful in a loving way that benefits others as well as yourself powerful you leo are so so powerful you don't sometimes know don't know your power well i think you do but um powerful definitely in at work with your ideas and how bonkers they are not um yeah let's have a look here we go as you honor and follow the guidance of your heart prosperity is coming to you now hence we have the ten of pentacles and no conditions aren't aren't favorable right now wait to look into other options and ask angels to help guide and comfort you and i think that probably is regarding the a little muddy kind of situation at the end of the month so don't rush into commenting what other people are doing raise above and things are sorted things are sorted move on to move on to your whatever you're doing and be focused and busy with what you're doing take action here we have like dreams need a practical plan so at the, especially at the beginning of month i think Mm, sometimes Leo can be carried away with daydreaming and imagining having that big 
big car and big fancy house or so action is needed and I, and i'm pretty sure leo that you are going to be be such a person be assertive be assertive yes indeed wow what a month for you guys leo very good month i, I believe very good month yeah let me know what you think uh, in the comment section and anyways look after yourself have a great month thanks for being here and i'll see you in the next reading Ta da